I can only say to my Chinese friends that having seen your spectacular achievement over the 50 years in which I have been acquainted and also having enjoyed the benefits and joys of a civilization that so extraordinarily mixes the intellectual and the historic and the practical, that the next phase will be that both of our countries seek to find universal expressions that permit other societies to participate on the basis of equality and non-interference in the promises that our world offers to defeat pandemics, to overcome natural catastrophes, to improve the climate, to work in cooperation with each other, to exchange our views honestly and without pressure. These seem to be worthy objectives, worthy of your great civilization and our historic aspirations as Americans, so that we can maintain, of course, a certain competition which is inherent, but distill from it a level of cooperation that enables us to look into a common future of peace, prosperity, and dignity 